Nyoma bia eya ye allow e ma obunsam e di nya ye ho kwan. There are three doors that when we open the devil used to enter our home and destroy us. That's the last thing that I want to share with you. And if you be able to close these doors, you'll be a better person. And what are the doors that I'm talking about this morning? The eye gates. That's the first door you need to close. The ear gates. That's the next door you need to close. And the last one is the mark gates that you need to close it. These are the three doors that the devil used to enter our home and destroy us. Why am I saying this? Look, the eye gate. This refers to what we watch, read, and allow our eyes to see. The devil can use virtual temptation, pornography, um, violence, and other harmful content to gain false hold in our life. So what our eyes sees, the yeni ehu ene de o how de braye. Inti eni we ya e da da yen e da da yen sa ne e di ashe enyoma eni kwanza yeshe yeshe we ana fe ajeno afa na fe ye di di ye hu ye hu ye hu boni eni da da fu ya ne da da yen em ye take wrong decision in life. So if you will be able to close the eye gates, my dear, you will be a better person. The next gate is the ear, the ear gate. This represents what we listen to, including music, gossip, and negative conversation. The devil can use harmful words and ideas to influence our thoughts and attitude. The ear gates. And the very last one, the mouth gate. This is what we say and speak out loud. The devil can use our own words against us. Temptation to speak negative and harmful, which can bring harmful to ourselves and others. That's the mouth gate. The idea no eka. What we use our mouth to say and no ena elidi into and social bibri anasa mani bibri yenemu e e kwadanda bibri yenemu e ye de ye ye de ya no eka. What we use our mouth to say, and sometimes we don't even say it even silent, we say it very loud. Anu ya, no, I'm sorry, no, I'm sorry, 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 i am sorry 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 it's because you talk too much. You don't even know how to close your mouth. You don't even know when to talk and when not to talk. You just open your mouth. Baga ya. You are poor in something you go no more. Harmful words. You see, we sometimes talk too much. And the devil will use our own words against us. There was a man who, who, who said, look, I used to say that I will never travel, right? I will never travel to any country. I will stay here and make it in life. I will stay here and do whatever that I have to do. A time came in his life and he wanted to travel. And then it was so difficult. He tried several times and then he fails. Why? One day he said that I will never travel. I will stay here. So the devil was using that same words against him that you said that you never travel. You never go to any country. So now, what have changed? What do you want? Where do you want to go? I will never allow you to go. We talk too much. If you will not do something, don't mention it loud for people to hear. Don't mention it loud. Keep it here. Know how to zip your mouth. Know when to talk, when not to talk. Because the devil, if the devil will get us, he will use our own words against us. When the devil was tempting Jesus, he quoted from the Bible. He uses Jesus' own inspiration against him. And Jesus was able to rebuke him back by the same words. So know when to zip your mouth. Know when to talk. Know when not to talk. The eye gates. And I'm a bunny adoso. And also. No when to watch. No one not to watch. No when to hear. No when not to hear. No when talk. No when not to talk, my dear. If you will be able to close these three major gates in life, these three gates, the eye gates, the ear gates, and then the mouth gates, you will be a better person tomorrow. You will be that great person tomorrow. So, my dear, I'm here to tell you, these are the three gates, the three gates that the devil used to get us. That is the mouth gates, the ear gates, and then the eye gates. If you're able to close these three major gates, my dear, 
you'll be a better person tomorrow just know how to close this major door and then you will see that now things will begin to turn around for you do you think everything that you see that you need to talk about it do you think everything that you hear that you need to talk about it do you think everything that your mouth should say something about it sometimes just keep quiet and look i am not but that's just him you see the edge of one who are or you didn't know come in who are or you did the one the end of a jam one who are or good and you go so no come on who are or yeah who did it so you ask yourself these two animals say oh compare to now one pan in the answer jam one would be my answer off sometimes when you be a db switch there one i see a trailer dear be a young fan young fan chair was a fat to one of your cousin be good was summa young kangu was soon as a fat to one of si ye ka bibi chire wa ye nkan chire wa se fatu wano ne fo bo de kuro mo biya nti bi it is for you know how to zip your mouth know how to control your listening ear know how to control your 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 eyesight e ni ya ane dada ye asu ya ane dada ye anu ya ane dada ye so my dear i'm here to tell you if you'll be able to know how to close these three major doors you'll be a better person tomorrow the doors that are being closed before you all those doors will begin to open what does the bible actually says now the eye gates in matthew 6 22 and 23 but the eye is the lamp of the body if your eye are healthier your whole body will be full of light but if your eye are unhealthy your whole body will be full of darkness matthew chapter 6 verse number 22 23 the eye is the lamp of your body. If your eye are healthier, your whole body will be full of light. Say when ni eya, when ni pedu ni nyina, eya kanea. Say when ni ye papa, when ni pedu ni nyina ye kanea. Na say when ni duma, say when ni duma. And when ni pedu ni nyina ba sum. The ear gates, Proverbs chapter 4 verse 23. My dear, guide your heart above your all ears for the determination cause of your life. Listening to a handful words can affect your heart and then your mind. Proverbs chapter 4 verse 23. My dear, look, if you'll be able to know how to close these three major doors, you'll be a better person tomorrow. The mad gates, Proverbs chapter 10 verse number 19. And this, this is what the Bible actually says. Proverbs chapter 10 verse 19. Proverbs chapter 4 verse 23. Matthew 6, 22. Matthew 6, 22, 23. All these are Bible facts about the doors that we need to close in our home so the devil don't enter our home and then destroy us. Your home is you. Your whole body. Your home is you. Your home is you. Know how to close these three major doors and you will be a better person tomorrow. God bless you so much. For tuning in, this is your number one work class radio station, KJ Radio. The name is King James. I love you so much. All KJ Radio listeners, all KJ Radio viewers across the world. God bless you. Always making the time to tune into KJ Radio. Make sure you share, like, comment on all social media platforms. And also make sure you drop your comment as well. Um, copy the link, invite people, share our page to people. And also make sure they follow us. Download our amazing app on Google Play Store, Apple Play Store. When you download the app, all that you need to do, just log on and listen to KJ Radio. And we don't charge you anything. It is absolutely free. We don't charge you even 10 pesos. So make sure you get tuned. Make sure you download the app and then make sure you listen to us all the time. 